just received a phone call from one of my close comrades, Comrade Supra Mahomu Pelu, informing me that on social media, there's a letter from the National Disciplinary Committee of the African National Congress making the rounds, saying that I've been expelled by the National Disciplinary Committee from the African National Congress. I have not received that letter personally. This letter was simply sent out into the public domain by that kangaroo call that called themselves the National Disciplinary Committee. It is utterly unacceptable that any person who is personally affected, as I am by such a ridiculous decision by the National Disciplinary Committee of the ANC, must hear about this on social media, and there's not even the most basic decency to first ensure that I'm informed about this vindictive decision of the National Disciplinary Committee. During the last year and more, I've been subjected to persecution by the National Disciplinary Committee of the African National Congress on the basis of me having said at Nkandla on the 4th of July, 2021, and on several other occasions, that I believe acting on behalf of Umkontuisis Ve Military Veterans Association and speaking as the national spokesperson of MKMBA, that the decision of the Constitutional Court to have sentenced President Jacob Zuma without a proper court case was illegal, and that it indicates that our judiciary are captured. This was a decision that was taken formally by the National Executive Committee of MKMVA. And as the national spokesperson of NKMBA, I was given the instruction to travel to Nkandla and to deliver that message to President Jacob Zuma and also to hold a public press conference and make the views of NKMBA known. I carried out my duties diligently and did exactly that. In the meantime, I noted 